Races in play. Let's let's look at the race. So <sighs> run out quickly. I usually pick a horse to sort of concentrate on, so I'm looking at number one. And I'm tempted, I'm tempted to lay number one. If it starts to go backwards because it's done too much. Or has it just got a naturally very high cadence? So I'm always laying and I'm laying. Is there a lay opportunity? It's not going backwards, it's coming forwards. So it's cadence is doing it some good. Number two gets a lay. Because it's going backwards. And it's very, very high on cadence. So that was a good decision. Now it's between these two. So number one's not going to so fight. It's best on there, it's best on there, it's best on there. It's clearly going to win, but there's no value in it. So pretty low value. This is where my staking decision of having it on 20 uh, and clicking it multiple times didn't, uh, didn't do me that many favours because I really don't have time to put one bet on. But, um, but I still stand by that, that decision there. Number two fell off the back of the screen. I could see that it did far too much in the cadence and it wasn't going to challenge. 